Hello dear friend, dear meditator, welcome back to our YouTube channel for another guided meditation. I am your host, your guide, and as always I am truly honoured to be a part of your journey. If you enjoy these meditations, you might also enjoy getting a new meditation every single day. I post daily meditations on Patreon. By becoming a patron, you get daily downloadable meditations, as well as exclusive videos and content, monthly Zoom meetings with me, Q&A sessions, and special discounts on upcoming courses and meditation retreats. Not only will you enjoy all these perks, you will be supporting the channel in our mission to simplify and demystify meditation, transcendence and awakening, and spread these beautifully simple techniques to the world. So please do have a look and sign up now on www.patreon.com slash Raphael Writer. That's Patreon, P-A-T-R-E-O-N dot com slash Raphael Writer. All the links and information are available in the description notes under this video. So without further ado, let us begin on today's meditation. Make sure you won't be disturbed during the entirety of this meditation. Approximately 20-25 minutes. Give yourself a 5 minute buffer though at the end so that you can contemplate and ponder on a thought that I will give you in the part 2 of this meditation. In part 1 we'll be doing a meditation for transcendence, transcending the self, the illusion of the self, the ego, the thought, so that you may experience your natural state that you may experience who you are at the core of your existence. And of course, reducing the illusion that you are separate from nature, realizing, this is what we might call awakening or being enlightened, is the full realization on a non-intellectual level that your skin is not a wall but a bridge. And that you are the world. Just like your lungs or your heart belongs to you. Or part of you. Belongs not in a possessive way, but in a natural way. In an exis existential way. So does the sun. And the trees. Because they make the oxygen that you need to breathe, and so they are just as much part of you as your lungs. So as I speak now, take the opportunity of course to settle in. I don't want you to start these meditations right away, I want there to be a little buffer so that you can sit, relax, find your center of gravity so that you may sit in balance, reducing as much as possible muscular tension, Letting go of anything that happened before this moment. And of course, letting go of all expectations, goals, yearnings for outcomes of this session. Every day is different, every meditation is different. And so we must remember that. Sit as you would if you were the best version of yourself. Sit with dignity, take space vertically, horizontally. In balance, as I just said, on your two sit bones. You don't have to sit in any kind of fancy meditation position. No. If you want to sit on a chair, sit on a chair on the edge of your bed. As long as you're available for this experience. And that you're comfortable. Close your eyes. Hands to the heart as we dedicate this session to someone. It can be anybody that you choose. Deep breath in through the nose. And on the exhalation, we project our love, gratitude and appreciation towards that person. Take an extra moment to imagine, visualize, feel that person receiving your projection, your energy, your love. Notice the bond you've created and that you don't have to touch someone to be with someone, which is much more complex than that. 
will now start the vibration. It will be very soft so you might not hear it yet, but it's there. And when you find it, gently, effortlessly, naturally, put your focus, your attention on that vibration and keep it there during the entirety of the session. It will last approximately 15 minutes-ish. Don't try to count the time. <laughs> no, let go. When thoughts come, very simply go back to the vibration. Don't judge the thoughts, don't try to eliminate them. When the sound fades out and disappear, let it resonate in your mind, reproduce it there for a few extra moments.
may now let go of the vibration. The meditation is over. If you feel like it, take a nice big deep breath. Open your eyes. Let your body do what your body wants to do. Stay there in this calm, this peace, this stillness that you've created with this beautiful meditation. And take the opportunity now to stay seated and to ponder or contemplate on the most important questions of life, on your existence, on nature. I will give you a quote that I've posted recently on Instagram. It's by Amit Ray, who says, Suffering is due to our disconnection with the inner soul. Meditation is establishing that connection. End of quote. If I, if I would change just one thing, it's re-establishing that connection. Because that connection, you've had it. As I observe my very young kid, I can see that he has this connection to nature, to himself. Not yet corrupted by his intelligence or what we might call humanity. He's just here and there experiencing with his senses, with his feelings. And when we start to speak and when we start to think, we disconnect to nature, to our soul, to who we really are. Meditation and other mindfulness practices like walking in the woods or bathing in the river helps us to reconnect not to go to a higher state or to higher, have a higher level of consciousness or anything like this because this is putting the ego first it's not really about you the expression of who you are but more about the real you and the real you is not just you inside your skin is you and the world so think about this today ponder about that and go back re-establish that connection so much for being here today for taking the time and giving yourself the opportunity the gift of being present in the moment of being calm of stillness and experiencing the core of who you really are remember that it doesn't matter if today was deep or not so deep it is all part of a process the important thing is to keep practicing and to make your mindfulness and meditative practices as consistent as you can. If you're interested, remember that you can have access to daily meditations with me, as well as other cool perks by becoming a supporter of Meditation with Raphael on Patreon. I highly recommend that you subscribe to my weekly letter that I send out once a week, where I share thoughts on meditation, mindfulness, self-transcendence, and living a great life, as well as news on the content I post on the podcast, on YouTube, and on the blog. You can sign up there for free directly on my website, www.raphaelwriter.com. Have a look at the links in the show notes for the Patreon page, the podcast, the links to the blog, the free weekly letter, and ways to get in touch with me. I always love hearing from you, so do not hesitate to send me a message on Twitter or Instagram or directly on my email. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, to share these meditations with anybody that might benefit from them, and until next time, 
Remember that I see you, I feel you, and I appreciate you. Take care. Bye-bye.